Good morning, YouTube. Just to give you a little quick recap on my day. I did some cold calling this morning from about 9 to 11. Headed to lunch right now with my buddy. Noah, you're the man. If you're watching this, typically this is what a day consists of. Um, always try to start the day with a routine. Always try to uh, please to get an hour of cold calling in the mornings. You know, when I first got in the business, first year, I didn't really have a routine and it killed me. It was so difficult to actually like do my, you know, just wake up every day and actually be productive just because I didn't have really any set things to do. You know, with real estate, you're essentially you're your own business owner and you actually have to find that motivation and you actually have to, you know, get up and make something happen. And that was very difficult for me. But now it's a little easier, you know, as you know, you get a lot busier and you keep that routine. You know, you never know what's gonna happen um, with real estate. You just never know how your day is gonna be, but it's always good to have some sort of routine so that you wake up and that you can be held accountable for things. Um, so that's typically what I do in the mornings, just, you know, hit the phones, try to prospect, try to get new business, try to just talk to people and meet people and let them know what I do for a living. And then I always try to, you know, I think I've talked about this before, is I always try to um, have lunch with someone. You know, just somebody that you, you don't, you wouldn't typically have lunch with, you know, kind of pick their brain for ideas. Um, you know, they pick your brain and, and it's just a good way to meet new people too and get business going. So that's kind of so far how my day's going. I have a closing at two and a closing at four. So I won't be able to bring you with me to those, but um, and a showing at six. I'm showing at six, but other than that, just always be working and always be closing. See you guys later. All right, closing number one of the day is over. Got that taken care of. Now, as we wait on closing number two, I figured it's a good time for learning moment of the week. Four things that you need while submitting an offer. Okay, first. You need the offer. Secondly, you need a pre-approval from your mortgage lender. Get with your local lender, get with your favorite lender, get that pre-approval. It'll need to be for the exact same price of the offer. Thirdly, you need a proof of funds. Give that to your lender to just to prove that you have the money for the down payment. And four, number four, you need a great realtor. So get with the realtor of your choosing and submit that offer. Hopefully it's it's me. <laughs> All right, guys, it's getting close to the holiday season, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna give out Texas Roadhouse gift cards to strangers, just to the complete strangers in the middle of Target. We're gonna see how it goes. I don't have a clue, but it's the holiday season. Hey, add some Christmas music. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Have you my Have you got to get back. Hey, man. Hey, this Oh, Oh my gosh, guys, that was so awesome. We're going to continue to do this every now and then. So hit the button below and subscribe because we're making a giveaway for our subscribers. You guys have a Merry Christmas.